to Rogue Quest, the Crypt of the Leech King. New game. Well. Well indeed, yes, well. Oh, I've got, I've got a click, okay. It looks like I have arrived. It has been not an easy trip, to be honest. The map wasn't very clear. I almost got lost in the swamps. And the cannibal savages out there really wanted to bite a bit of me. But in the end, here I am. I, Conrad Meridian, the most renowned explorer and adventurer ever, have just reached the legendary Crypt of the Leech King. Myths speak of epic treasure cursed by agent beings. Well then, let's see if the treasure is as great as they say. Clang. What? The gate closed suddenly? Maybe a trap? Well, I'll surely find a way to open it. Let's go then. So he's a bit big-headed, this guy. Am I supposed to... Okay, hold on one second. Okay, and we're back. So it's a point and click type game. So I'm sorry that you're going to hear a lot of mouse clicking. A grim show indeed, probably an adventurer who arrived here long before me. He failed, but he was surely much less skilled than me. He looks like a zombie. Well, let's take his bag. Let's loot him. One man's trash. Another man's treasure. Let's see if had anything that can be helpful then. I royally butched that one up. Well, nothing useful, apart from an ancient knife. It may come in handy. That torch could easily be of use. I lost mine a few hours ago. Unfortunately, this one is bolted to the wall. Many bolts are loosened already. Still, I'd need something hard and long. <laughs> to use as a lever to remove it. Well, how about these wood poles here, for example? Who knows why they're here? Maybe some unfinished works. Who cares? Mine! Yes, take them, and then... Do I just click on this, or do I actually have to... Oh, okay. Show interactive elements. Oh. The pole is neither thick nor hard enough to be used as a lever here. It would probably break them. Uh, break, and then you something thicker and harder. Well, because you're stuck up, maybe... No? No? No, okay, well, alright then. Oh, hello. This is quite demonic. Hey, what's this sensation? Touching that skull seems to activate some sort of sorcery. I believe I'll have to break it open. Break it to open this door, even. Let's see how it works. Oh, this is like a memory game. But do I have to go in order? Oh shit, don't fuck me up like that. No. Oh, you're fucking joking, right? Thank God. If that got any harder, or if there were more sequences to it, I would not have been able to remember. Okay, so it's open now. What's this clay urn? The urn contains some kind of sticky substance. I better not touch it with my bare hands. Oh, don't be a wuss, just do it. Grid, the grid closes an old well. Hey, I can see something shining down there. This kind of feels like deja vu for some reason. Can we use the wooden poles? The pole fit inside the grid and I reached some tra Oh my god. And I reach to touch the shining item down there. But I'm unable to take it using only the pole. I'd need to use something else, I believe. 
it's far too dark to go in there. See a trap in order to avoid dying. That doesn't really show anything. Strange wall. The wall seems quite weird and fragile. So maybe we can punch it down? I don't like you, wall. I don't like you at all! Hurrah, 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 hurrah! Wall cracks. Crack. Okay. There is a large crack in the wall now. I believe it's about to collapse. Well, keep doing it then, come on. For justice! Yeah, okay, get on with it. And look who we found here. Another adventurer? A prisoner? People tend to die here quite a lot, it seems. Hey, there is something shining within the bones. Oh, I don't see anything. Unless you mean this diary. It looks like a diary. Well done. Should I read it or later? Just read it. Read it. Oh dear, there are several readable pages. Uh. Okay. Here's the last entry. 16th of Aprune. 425th year under King Pokeoka. I am. Oh my. Really? I am Trovan, the wise, mage, and hero. Because of my skills, the king sent me, together with my fellow, Juro the First, to the crypt of the Leech King. The king believed that the two of us could stop the monster, and perhaps recover its magnificent treasure. Sadly, the king overestimated our skills just as much as we did. We've been lost in this dungeon for three days now. Traps, monsters and shadows haunted us without mercy. Now we decided to split. Joro is trying to escape. When I doubt he'll make it. I am injured because of a fearsome ghost. I destroyed it, but it fatally wounded me. I don't have much more to live. I'll use my last ounce of power to cast a wall to protect my body and my diary. I hope it will be of help in the future for the destruction of this horrible monster. To open the door with the skulls, follow the skulls' eyes. Well, I've already done that. Good luck. That's all. It was long. Anyway, let's go now. Search for something about the crypt. There are various notes about the crypt. Summarising, it looks like the entrance is sealed by the Leech King's power. So, to open it, the easiest way seems to be destroying the Leech King. I like it. It looks like the author knew quite a bit about undead and dark magic. Here's some interesting facts. Why is it so loud all of a sudden? Turn you down. Oh crap, I missed that. Uh, a, phylact a phylactery, to be precise. To destroy the leech, I'd have to destroy the phylactery. Unfortunately, the phylactery is enchanted and almost impossible to break without magic. Good enough for me, there is a possible solution to this in this diary. I apparently need to mix the remains of two powerful undead creatures. Mix those with some fresh living blood and put the phylactery- I don't know if I'm saying that right, I'm probably not. In such a mix, uttering certain magic words. Okay, I can do it. Oh, that is a lot of reading. Can we take this with us? Yes we can. A brick, it could be useful. Alright. Hole. There is a small hole on the floor. Perhaps there once was some kind of statues or something there. After all, who cares? Well, it could be important. The pole would fit perfectly within there, but why should I do that? Oh, I don't know. Alright. Did we... We can't go in there, can we? No. I'm brave and all. I need to see a trap. Uh, so we need the torch for that. But we need something thick and... Okay, we didn't... Uh, the gate appears to be sealed. I sense supernatural forces at work here. I fear I'll have to find some expedient to reopen it. Okay, so there is hints up here, but... I mean, I shouldn't really need it, really, should I? Um, 
Can we break the grid? Well, I don't know. Punching it won't help. Can we use a knife on it? No, I thought not. Oh, come on. Don't be silly. Oh, his leg. Iron leg. It's an iron leg. My long gone friend here had a neat profess. God. Ugh. Oh. Prosthetic. Or prosthetic. Ugh. Oh, Okay, cool. I'll use it wisely, pal. Prospect it. Oh, I can't. That word always gets me. Okay, so. No, we don't want to use that. We don't want to use that. Yeah, well, I want to use the leg. Perfect, come here. Done. The torch is mine. Sadly, the iron leg is all bent now. Well, who cares? I doubt I could find another use for it here. He really doesn't give a shit, does he? I just need to have it. Okay, well, go on, go in there. There is a crack on the floor. The wearing of time, I presume. There's a locked door. It also looks extremely... It also looks extremely though. Though and resilient? I don't know, I think that's a typo there, I don't know. I fear I'll need a key to open it. You fear, do you? Okay. Is it the Leech King some kind of video game nerd? Maybe. Alright, let's go here. Uh, oh, I thought I... What the f... What's this popping up? Hold on. Something is popping up on my computer. Where are you? Oh, it's steam. Oh, why are you opening? No, go away. Not now. Not now. Thank you. Hello, vampire abomination. You look very pretty. Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy? Listen, pal. What are you doing here? I'm protecting my master's crypt from invaders. I'm its best minion, strong and fast. Moreover, hard to kill. Just to let you understand the trust my master has in me, I'll let you know I keep the key to his sanctuary. Okay, well, why aren't you attacking me? Because it's daytime, I'm a creature of the night, you fool. Let's be clear. If you were to attack me, I'd easily kill you. But, during the daytime, I hate to move more than necessary. Anyway, you're trapped here. So I don't care if you go around for a few more hours. As soon as the sun sets, I'll have your blood as a snack. Got it. Thanks for the advice, buddy. Uh, okay. Who are you? What are you? I am, of course, a terrible vampire. You look nothing like a fucking vampire. Uh, I see. I've never seen a vampire that likes you. The likes of you. It's because I was raised by an abomination. It's a long and weird story. Then I think I'll pass, thanks. And who's your master? It would be, of course, the fearsome and powerful Leech King. It has power over any imagination. It's my immortal master. Every mortal should bow before it. Alright. I mean... Everything is gone. There's a mirror. Hey, monster, why is there a mirror here? You are a foolish human. It's there to show you that I'm a vampire. You see? No reflection. Wah! Uh, see, it makes sense. Okay. You're kind of cute in a weird way. I don't really want to kill you, but I feel like we're going to. Um, no, I feel like I've got to do something here. Yes, but that means I'll have to kill him. And... 
Can I pick you up? No. I feel like this is cheating slightly, but I mean, I can do something with this, but it won't let me. Well, why not do that? Why not? Stick your hand in it. Stick the diary in it. No. Yes. <sighs> Can we cut open or smash? Oh, I think I tried doing this, didn't I? Like, where? I don't want to use hints, but I might have to at this rate. But why would I do that? What? Is there anything else we can do with this? No. Oh. I'm sorry. My internet keeps... My browser keeps opening up for some reason. That poster looks familiar to me. Oh, unless it's like... Yeah. Oh, okay. That opens up to... Ah, oh, I see. If you click on the poster, it opens up to Steam. Or like a page. I think that's pretty cool. Um, fuck it. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to be a cheat here. The vampire's mirror is mocking you. Maybe you should hit your reflection with a brick. Ah. Goodbye, myself in the mirror. Crash. Hey, why did you do that? The mirror was mocking you. Was it? Oh, good then. Thank you for getting rid of it then. I'll give you an extra hour of life as a gift. Thank you, pal. Can we collect them? There are two shards big enough to use. Right, okay. Uh. I. I mean, I don't really. Do I kill the abomination with this? Do I stab him? Do I punch him? No, okay. Uh... Oh, no, 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 maybe later, please. Okay. Maybe. Yes, I want to go through here. Maybe I can use it to reflect on something. It could be useful, but I'd need some support to put the mirror there. Oh, you're joking. Come on. You need some support? Try to use the poles in the urn in the corridor. I would never have thought of that. Like, what? Dipping the poles' extremities in the urn, I can make them sticky. Done. And now? Why have I got two mirrors? Oh yeah. I did this a lot as a child to recover things from the drain. Let's see. Gotcha. Here. Recovered. Oops. I broke the pole. Well, it served well. What is this? It looks like a magical jewel. Maybe. It could be. For the adventure. I see now. It's, it is the Leech King's... Ugh. Phylactery. Great. It would surely be of use. I don't even know what. Where's the. F okay. Can I stick you down there? I should figure out something better. I know, why have you gone down there? Okay, so can I. I want to use you. With you. And done. What did I do then? Oh, mirror on a stick. There, it fits perfectly. It's reflecting the sunlight, sending it downwards. Okay, so we have light shining now. No, 
I don't know why I'm doing that. I'm done. Okay, so I have to put this... Oh, no, I can't put it in there, can I? Uh... There's something I've got to do with that, right? No. <sighs> hmm. Can I use you on you? No. I hate to do this. So. Oh well. The hole in the corridor and the crack downstairs are good for me on a stick. Yes, but I didn't I try doing that? Apparently I didn't click on it. There, and now... Wow, the sunlight is being reflected from one mirror to the other. And it's going straight to... Ah! No. No, not the sunlight! Ah! The vampire's room. Well, one wants the less to be afraid of. Oh no. I feel quite bad, actually. I'll take the vampire's ashes. I believe I'll be able to find a good use for them. Hey, look here. There was a key inside the vampire. Time to face the Leech King, then yay! An urn, yay. Okay, so we can use this key now to open the The key fits. Door opens. Click. Let's see what's behind the door. Oh, okay. Right. Just straight up, you know, it's the Leech King. Hey, I'd like to take it, but I believe the Leech King could differ about that. Maybe I should destroy it first. Hello. Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. Who are you? <laughs> Who am I? Who do you think I am? I don't know what voice to do, really. A giant leech. How dare you! You puny mortal. <laughs> I am the Leech King. Fear me. Um. Could you open the gates? What are your powers? Couldn't I take your treasure? Yeah, can I take treasure? No, you can't. I spent centuries to hoard it. Could you open the gates for me? Moreover, you're about to die soon. Fool, the only way to open the gates is to destroy me! Right. Ah, don't you know, foolish mortal? His voice has just changed. I am a leech, but behold, I am also a lich. I have powers beyond your imagination. I can raise the dead to serve me. I can summon the darkness. I can, well, I can do a lot of things. So why haven't you killed me yet then? I'm not complaining, to be honest. I'm just curious. I will kill you soon! I'm just thinking of the best curse to use on you. <laughs> It'll be great, but not for you. Waha. <laughs> is there a way to defeat you? I mean, you seem so strong. I bet there is no way to defeat you. 
Am I right? Well... To be honest, I have but one weakness. But of course, you're way too smart to say it out loud, aren't you? Of course! Did you take me for an idiot? I am far too wise to tell you my secret. I would never tell you that my powers come from my... phylactery. I... Th what? I... Nor would I tell you that I lost my precious phylactery in the script years ago. Surely I would never ever tell you that my precious is enchanted. And because of that, indestructible. But if I were to use a curse on it, my magic would retort on me. I will never tell you about uh, anything about it. I see, in that case, I'll have to find another way to fight you, I'm afraid. <laughs> indeed, Maha. Good luck on that, Maha. Maha, indeed, right. Nope. I'll have to do this the right way. Hey, Leech King. What do you want, mortal? Ugh. To challenge you, maybe? To challenge me? <laughs> and what kind of challenge were you thinking of, mortal? Okay, so... <laughs> A magic challenge? Aha! Very well then. Prepare yourself, mortal, for I am to use my most powerful spell. Okay. Aya, gulare, blue, mana banana. Go, vortex of the never minding pain of the solar sun and the dead heart of the black dragon. Oh snap, I really hope I figured it out well. Go, magical phylactery, shield me. What? No, no, you cheater, no. No, no, my magic is reflecting against me. No. Quail. Yeah, it worked. It looks dead, for now. Sadly, until I destroy the phylactery, it won't be permanent. I'll have to destroy it ASAP. I'm pretty sure these could be useful. I just have to understand how. Gotcha. The treasure is mine. Now I just have to get out of here. Yes. Uh Oh, can I use them? Can I use it? Can I use it? I'll need something much more powerful than to destroy than that to destroy this evil artifact. Punch it. Let's try. Oomph! As I thought my fist isn't enough to break it, I'll have to find a way to destroy it. Can I open it? Or I just have to take it out of here. Can I put the ashes? I'll put that in the urn after I have somehow treated it. Treated it? What do you mean treated it? Can I put the vampire ashes in there? Treated it, so, okay. Maybe, I don't know, stick. Can't waste it, well, I don't know. How do I treat ashes? Like why? There's no interactive elements here. Do I put it on fire? Let's mix them. Here we are. I'll put them in the urn. Let's go. Let's go. Well, hold on. What do I do then? Do I use... Must be careful with that. Okay, let's read this diary. Okay, uh... Okay, so it's... A soul is in that thing there. I'd have to destroy it. Unfortunately, it's enchanted and almost impossible to break without magic. 
There is a possible solution. I apparently need to make the remains are too powerful. I did that. Mix those with fresh living blood. Okay, I really forgot the I forgot the last bit, but okay, so. Okay then, blood it is. Ouch. Done. Now I have my blood on the blade. Fine. And then drop the blood in there. I made a strange substance. I must be careful though, it corroded the knife, dissolving it. Yuck. And put that in there. And now, you evil spirit, in the name of whatever you want, I compel you! Or something like that. No, how dare you! No! I'll return! Uh... I doubt you will. Good news, the evil leech is no more. Now I should be able to open the gates and leave this place. Now that the curse is broken, nothing should keep me here. Yay! Treasure? Check. Leech destroyed? Check. I have everything I need. Time to go. I can't wait to spend this treasure. On one hand, it is sad how fast one can deliberate so much wealth. On the other hand, it's great how easily I'll be able to find more. Let's go then. First the party, and then... New adventures ahead. The end for now. Alright then. Oh, that's that. Um, it was... Apart from a few bits that I was kind of unsure on, it wasn't too difficult. Um, the dialogue was a little funny, I guess. It was a good game. Um, it would be good if it was longer, which I hope they're working on, but yeah, it's just a little fun point and click game, so I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.